Let's talk about 65. I almost said 69. Damn it. This is the problem with a dyslexic person review because I'm terrible with numbers. This is the problem with a dyslexic person reviewing a movie that's literally just a number. 65. Let's review 65. So this movie um, stars Adam Driver and is about this this pilot named Mills. He's sort of tasked with piloting this research vessel. Basically, um, the planet he's from sends a spaceship out to go to a, a different planet and research it, you know, an exploratory mission. And Mills, the character that Adam Driver plays, is in charge with making sure that it goes from point A to point B. Um, and uh, he unfortunately sort of crashes into an uncharted meteor or um, um, an un yeah um, oh damn you know um, asteroid belt there you go an uncharted asteroid belt and ends up crash landing on the primordial earth and ha uh, has to get him and a girl named uh, Koa to safety while also contending with dinosaurs now that the, the the fact that it's earth 65 million years ago is a bit of a reveal but it's in the first 16 minutes of the film and i feel like the trailers kind of spoil it and i think the back of this spoils it too so like what the writers of of um a quiet place sort of intended to be a reveal the marketing unfortunately had to spoil because it's you know a movie and those trailers are always meant to get butts in the seats and yeah this is a pretty good little movie it's not great it's not gonna like win any oscars or anything like that but it's an enjoyable flick that i think it's only real the only real issue i had is that it maybe tries to make you care a little too much about Mills and Koa. Like, this movie easily could have been uh, still 90 minutes long. Like, it's 93 minutes long, I think, some, somewhere around there. Um, it's a short movie. It's, you know, you, you can watch it in, in, a, in the morning before you go to work, which is kind of what I did. Um, and it's a nice, you know, like I said, a nice enough movie, but it most certainly is like, hey, you know, here is this story. Here is you know what it's about and stuff like that but mills also has a bit of a backstory and i don't know i feel like i'm never gonna say no to a backstory especially if it really does inform the character which i kind of think it does or at least informs adam driver's performance because adam driver being you know like uh martin scorsese said being one of the greatest uh um, actors of of our time um, greatest performance of our time is allowing that to inform his performance but it is most certainly a thing of of like we don't need the backstory it, this easily could have been just about a, a dude and a, a little girl going from point a to point b while being crash landed on an alien planet um and a positive i'll say Besides Adam Driver doing a good job in making this movie, I think, a little bit better than it, than it usually would be. Because this is very much feels like a science fiction sort of B-movie from the 50s, you know? Um, like, they would have made this in the 50s if they came up with the idea of, um, instead of um, us humans crash landing on an alien planet and it being filled with monsters, aliens crash land on our planet and it's filled with the monsters of our of our planet, which would be dinosaurs. And yeah, there's also a few dinosaurs, I think like two, that I had never heard of. Now, I'm not like a, you know, a, a dinosaur expert, um, but I, I don't know. I feel like I would have heard about some, like the two dinosaurs that they, I feel like made up for this movie. And uh, there's two encounters with bugs in this film that honestly were more terrifying than the um 
than the the dinosaur encounters, honestly. And one of them literally is like my worst nightmare brought to me on screen. Like it's really, um, t like not to sound hyperbolic, but it was really genuinely like I think terrifying, um, and not in like a good way. But yeah, that being said, um, sixty five I think is most certainly worth a watch. Um. If you wait a few months, it'll probably be on Netflix because it's a Sony movie. But it's most certainly, I think, uh, worth a pickup on, like, DVD or maybe a rent scene on Voodoo. Um, uh, uh, thank you to our most recent subscriber. We are now at 34. Um, thank you for subscribing. And, uh, yeah. Um, it's It's nice to have, like, another subscriber, but it's also just, like... Oh, someone else who watches, who's going to probably watch more of my videos and realize that I'm not necessarily the best at this. Um, but yeah, no, it's fun. I, I'm trying my best and I mainly make these videos for myself. Um, I may have one other video coming down the pipeline this week. I don't know. Um, I love how last week I said that there wouldn't be, that uh, last week is the last week of... Um, three videos a week, but then I just, I get this movie and I'm like, yeah, I can talk about this very quickly. I, I, I got time. But yeah, um, remember the guy made special. He loves you very much. So I hope you have a very nice day and as always, God bless y'all.